Welcome to this is the most exciting addition to Business Central 2021 Wave 2, aka version 19. Hey, I'm Eric, and uh, normally these little videos are all about development and um, AL programming, software design, and so on. But but you know, once in a while, Microsoft are actually doing something that I have asked them for for so long and and for me this feature or no it's not even a feature this addition this fix whatever you want to call it to version 19 aka business central 2021 wave 2 long name is just so exciting this is, is this is really something that i've been waiting for for a long time and i have had so many calls from customers telling asking me why the system is doing something stupid i have heard about so many people who are stuck with the role taylor client on windows because they think that the the web client is not usable and stuff like that so oh that was a lot of talk let me actually show you what i'm talking about um here is the general journal uh and uh, the general journal is an exciting place because well it's not but, but that's because i'm a developer but but for this is this is where some users are working eight hours a day what i'm all i'm talking about also applies to let's say that you have people who are working in the sales module eight hours a day they enter sales order, they edit sales orders, or perhaps they're working purchase and, and working with purchase orders, or they're in the warehouse or something, that there's still a lot, lots of users, who, even though we're in this new, exciting world of integrations and all that stuff, you know, they are just putting data into the system day in and day out. And um, one of the things that has been the hallmark of personal computers since IBM since IBM built the first PC 40 years ago was the keyboard buffer the fact that you could type and even though that the program behind you the program receiving what you type might get behind once in a while the computer had a keyboard buffer that would just store what you were typing and then when the program was ready to process what you type it will grab from the keyboard buffer and then you it then it will work and and yeah i i know of cases where because the, the default keyboard buffer for decades were 30 characters meaning that when, when if you type more than 30 characters that the program behind was not accepting you will have the little bell ringing saying that you 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 over type you fill out the buffer um maybe only old geeks like me who remember that but the the concept of remembering what you type and just you know process uh, uh, on has been an integrated thing of the pc for forever and um, microsoft broke this they broke this uh with the with the web client meaning that whenever you did something in the in 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 the list control where, where you were typing lines or fields and something that it will it it would lose keystrokes that uh, that if processing took place that you had the cursor on on the line and then you could there was a time between going from one line to the, to the next line and if you typed in that time those keystrokes would never get recorded so people will call me up and say hey, eric the system is slow or the system is not doing as i'm typing or I'm, I'm getting errors because it's it's getting behind and it was much better in the old days and blah 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 uh, and this is now fixed so so let me show you here just a couple of examples for, about what i'm talking about so here i have a the general journal and one of the hallmark keystroke series of Business Central, well, most not, but, but Nav and Vision, Dynamics and all that, you know, is the F8, air down, F8, air down, F8, air down. So you, you're, you're going to copy the value below while you're creating new lines. And we can do that now 
in 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 Brazil. I know this is silly of me to get excited about, but but I am excited, and I'm excited on behalf of all my customers because they want to do this. So so now I, I can do F8, right? I can do error down and do F8, and and then I can speed this up. And this has never worked in the old versions. Well, of of the of Business Info, the the old versions of the uh, uh, the web client, but it works now. How cool is this? Um, and 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 well, this was F F eight, but but you know, I I can fill out stuff here, and and, and I, I know this is just silly me typing very fast on the keyboard, but. When I look at some of the power users that you know they actually have the numeric keyboard and and they can enter quantities or prices and so on and it's they're lightning fast and they're way faster than version 13, 14, 15, 16, and 17 and 18 were able to process. So they always lost the keystrokes, but now they don't. Yeah. Sorry, this is silly, but, but but this is truly truly awesome, and I think this takes apart from the fact that 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 we're gonna get way less support calls about the system being slow. This also is kind of removing one of the uh, the reason people stay on the Windows uh, roll tailor client because up until now, if you say, well, the web client is is throwing away my keystrokes, I I had no. <laughs> I have no defense for that. I can say, yeah, that's how it works, but not anymore. This is this is freaking awesome, and and this is truly gonna remove a lot of those uh, reasons that people would stay and 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 love the Windows terminal. Windows terminal. No, we all love the Windows terminal. But I'm I'm talking about loving the Revolt Taylor client, the Windows app, whatever we call it. These days, the old, uh, the old client, that one. Um, so, I know this is a a, a left field video for me, but uh, I truly think that this is like Microsoft could have released version nineteen, and the only thing compared to eighteen they added was this and user. Uh, happiness, whatever the, the metric is, uh, user satisfaction uh, would rise because this annoyed lots of users so much, and it it I I I I, I know that we think you know the software world that hey we do all these fancy integration and and stuff like that so nobody's ever gonna sit and type uh, hundreds of numbers into a into a general journal or lines on a sales order because there's you know and we do a web shop or we do an integration edi the other but the reality is that there's so many users every single day that are actually typing data into the system, typing, typing, typing. So this is very, very important. Anyway, enough talk about this little uh, topic. As you can hear, I'm super excited for this, and uh, I think this is great that they finally did it. Um, let me know in comments below if 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 what you think about this. How are how are your users? Uh, reacting to how it used to work and and do you think they are going to be excited about this let me know until next time have a wonderful day stay safe and i'll see you soon